Uh, my name is Joel Pedersen, superintendent at Cardinal Community School District. Uh, Cardinal Community School District is located in Wapalo County in southeast Iowa. Wapalo County was recently named by the Wall Street Journal as the poorest county in Iowa. So back in 2010, there was an opening for the superintendency at Cardinal School District. So like any aspiring superintendent, you go to your friends, you go to your mentors and you say, hey, what do you think about me applying for this job? And they flat out said, no, do not go there. The people that cared about me the most said, this is not the place we want you to start. We don't think you'll be successful there. Back in 2009, it was one of the toughest times for Cardinal Community School District. It was named in the 10% lowest achieving school districts in the nation. When something like that happens, you have to look to your culture. It was negative, it was toxic. Kids would say things like, we're just Cardinal. There was no pride in their school district. Attendance was low, achievement was low, our ACT scores were low. There was really um, nothing to be proud of that was happening in our school district at that time. And then 2010, everything changed. We started focusing on bringing more happiness to our school district. And it's been amazing with the educational outcomes that we've had over that time. One of the things that we're doing right now over the past three to four months to take our culture to a new level of happiness is we partnered with the Orange Frog Workshop. The Orange Frog Workshop uh, teaches principles of the happiness advantage in an easy to understand um, format using a metaphor of a orange frog named Spark. We're using that with our students and our staff to help our students understand the power of happiness in their everyday lives and helping them be more engaged in school. Because of the Orange Frog, you know, we have really started to focus on how we can be more positive and, and bring positivity into our school culture. And one of the things that we decided as a team is to make sure that our substitute teachers or substitute bus drivers, whoever is in our building as a sub, feels special. And so we go out of our way to check in with them uh, say, say hello, how you doing, how's your day going, is there anything you need? Since we've implemented this power of positivity and, and the power of orange, um, things have really shifted and um, everyone's saying positive things about our district, our employees are so much more positive and that in turn has spread out to our students and parents and other community members. One of the greatest outcomes of happiness rippling out into our community was in February 2015 when our taxpayers passed a $5.3 million bond to support our school district and to improve our school buildings. 2010, this would never happen. So our taxpayers believe in what we're doing and happiness is spilling over into our community and to our towns. If you want to have a great school, you have to have a great culture. If you want to have happy employees, you have to have a great culture. And happiness is the best place to start.